Good morning, YouTube. We are back at the shop, work on it, trying to get it open for business soon. So are you recording all of the nefarious activities? If you're new to the channel, my name is Dan, and in there is Josh, and he's actually here helping out today because he's back from vacation. We got a lot, oh, there he is. There's Josh. We got a lot of work to do, so I actually forgot to start filming when we got started, but I already insulated the garage door just using some foam insulation and some 3M spray glue, whatever. So I'll show you that in a minute, but I'm taking down the crappy corrugated metal. It's not exactly exciting, exciting work, but you know, we gotta get that down so that we can get the, the uh, reclaimed wood up. Josh is working on the office. So let me show you, ooh, yes, the office. It's finishing up the trim. We gotta finish up a little bit of paint work. There's our giant wood pile. Josh gets to work in luxury. It's air conditioned and it's only 74 degrees in here. We have the garage door open because the floors are still producing a ton of off-gassing that is just not it's pleasant. Really it's, it's not really pleasant. Bad. It's less than pleasant. My eyes are yeah, our eyes have been watery a little bit and uh, probably not good for us to breathe, but whatever. So they said uh, we can't put cars on it until tomorrow, so we're gonna wait till tomorrow for that. And you can actually feel it still feels a little bit soft. I think we wait till Sunday or maybe even Monday. Yeah, just give as much time as possible. No reason to screw it up, but we're coming along. So we'll show you the progress we make throughout the day and throughout the next few days. Oh, and by the way, like, share, and subscribe. Do us a favor and also check out NG Supercars, our dealership. That's what this whole thing's for. It's for parking some awesome supercars and having a place for you guys to come buy them from us. We actually just had a great idea. I love his idea. He said we should make the upstairs into like a little lounge with some bar stools so you can overlook the cars. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's gonna happen. We'll have to do that. It won't be right away, but we'll do it. All right, so we got most of the wall done. We're getting these really high up ones. These suck. This, this job sucked. Dude, the dude put so many screws on these panels. Like, oh, and the electrical boxes that were here, one of them had nine screws. Nine. Who needs nine screws to hold an electrical box to the wall? I don't know what, like, I told him, I told Josh, I'm like, dude, the guy was smoking some meth because this doesn't make any sense. Our YouTube, check it out. Does that look pretty sweet? Uh, so this is like quite a few hours of work. This is gonna take a very, very long time to do because there is a whole lot of wall. It's looking pretty good. It does look really cool. I took a picture. It doesn't really look as good in a picture. You kinda no. You gotta see it in person. I think you do kind of gotta see it in person, yeah. But it looks good on ca I can see it in camera and it looks good. I'll we'll be curious if it looks good with the car in front of it or not. We'll, we'll find out. Anyway, that's what we're doing for the backsplash. It's gonna be pretty cool. Uh, we did order some stuff for the walls, so we've got 55 metal panels coming. Uh, we decided to do that. As long as we're doing everything, let's just do it, get it done. Eventually. Well, good morning, YouTube. We're back at the shop. We gotta continue working on it. Check out the back wall. Josh continued work on this after I left on Friday evening, and man, it looks so, so very cool. So we're gonna continue work on that. I have to spray foam some stuff and our contractor is here working on some more stuff on the building itself, finishing up some trim and everything. I just wanted to show you, this is the fun part about living in the middle of nowhere. Every morning we get like crickets, but check out this beetle. That is the biggest beetle ever. He is massive. And over there in the other corner, there was a big old spider that had captured a cricket and was eating it. It was kind of creepy. It's one of those spiders that carries their young on the back. I know, like, ew. Once we get the doors, the garage doors, we'll be able to seal the, the you know, trim and everything, and then it won't get in so many bugs. The problem is right now, you, there's a huge gap, because, well, that panel is actually going to be removed. So, it is what it is. Let's hustle, see what we can do today. Okay, YouTube, you know how I've been saying we're going to do an indoor wash bay? So, right there, we got the water spigots, and we got a plug. So, we're going to have, like, the pressure washer and a dryer and all that stuff, but check this out. We ran a rubber strip all along here and there so it'll contain all the water and then when you're all done washing the car, that's going to be a garage door. Just take a squeegee and whoosh, squeegee it right out the building. Make that sound again. <laughs> you like that? <laughs> it's going to be pretty badass. I, we were just saying how it looks really cool and I'm super excited to be able to do this because holy crap, to be able to wash a car when it's like 105 out and not sweat to death, or, 
not in direct sunlight, so you don't have to worry about like washing it super fast and drying it super fast. Or hell, even in the winter, we do get some cold days and you're still gonna wanna wash the cars. So we're gonna order a curtain that we can kind of put around this entire area. So that's uh, next on the list, we need the curtain. This is cool, man, we're getting there. Check it out, first car in the shop. Well, first, you know, car we care about because, you know, I got the, the two Mustangs, which by the way, those are actually for sale if you want a Mustang. I don't know, like 30 something thousand for the GT500 and a couple grand for the Cobra. <laughs> it's an 01 Cobra. I have two, two, not one, but two blown engines for it. <laughs> I have the engine blocks, the heads and everything, but you probably need new rods and pistons. Definitely need new rods and pistons. But check this out. The wall is coming along. So we got the plugs, we got power. Oh, look, we got a place to sit. Yeah, chipping away at it. Huh? It's coming together good. It is coming together, yeah. So yeah, we're, we're uh, making progress. It's been a productive day and it's so much better inside. Oh my God, it's so much better with the AC. Anyway, uh, we'll chip away some more at tomorrow, so we'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow. Well, good morning, YouTube. We're back at the shop. Oh, <laughs> yes. I don't know why, but having that up on the wall makes me extraordinarily happy. I think it feels like we're getting progress. Check this out. We're looking much better. It's about, I don't know, almost half the wall, I guess. Although, that's going to be a bitch going way up there. Not excited about that. Well. We'll keep truck on the wall. We still have to finish up the office. Still got tons of stuff going on, so. Yeah, it's gonna be a long day. All right, YouTube, I'm not as good at the woodworking stuff as Josh, but I did the bar today, so I'm kind of proud of myself. It looks pretty decent, not bad. This whole uh, reclaimed wood thing is just awesome. It looks so, so cool. I can't wait to get the whole shop done. All right, YouTube, well, uh, we'll continue on and we'll see you in, well, tomorrow, I guess. So, see you then. Tomorrow for sure. All right, we're back at the shop. I just finished the bar area, so I did the vertical columns. Uh, actually, I've been on the phone a bunch today. We're making some deals. We're trying to get some new inventory. And now I actually need to run home because I'm making some food, and it's one of those things where I'm making food that takes all day, so I'm slow cooking some stuff. So I'm gonna need to jump home, and then I have to come back here because I got a guy coming to buy some stuff I have. So he's meeting me here. So I'm just running all over the place. So uh, yeah, fun, back and forth, back and forth. I listed that Cobra, the crap Cobra, the project Cobra that I've never really shown in video on Facebook Marketplace. And I am shocked, oh, let me turn the light. I am shocked at the number of people interested in it. It has been insane. Uh, wow, uh, apparently people want project cars. So this thing, with no engine, well, two broken engines, I've already had over 50 people want it. Why can't, why can't they want this? I, I need to get rid of this thing. It's taking up, they're both taking up space, so I, I decided we just, we need to just focus on what we do. So I just want to get rid of them. Um, so anyway, if, if you want either of those cars, uh, send me an email, sales at ngsupercars.com, and one of you can buy them or something like that, take them off our hands. Um, I'm letting them go for a loss on either of them. So they need to go away so that we can fit more Ferraris. So we got more Ferraris on the way. We're actually trying to buy three of them today. So today is a busy paperwork day and that's what I'm trying to do. So anyway, uh, I think that's gonna do it for this video. I just, I know it didn't get a whole lot done on the wall. Well, we got like half-ish -ish of the wall done. Josh is back in town tomorrow, so we'll probably get more of it done in the next few days. But all right, guys, that's to do it. Like, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell, and we'll see you in the next video. So stay tuned. It's going to be sweet.